Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today we are going to talk about laboratory calculations. If you take genetics laboratory class, I have a good news for you. There is not as many calculations in such lab as in chemistry lab. So basically you work with concentrated stock solutions which you have just to dilute. So today's problem is going to be about dilutions. So here is the problem of the day. A student made an initial 1 to 5 dilution of the phage lysate, then 2 milliliters of that was added to 8 milliliters of water. Lastly, the student made a 1 to 20 dilution of the second tube. What is the final dilution of the phage lysate? So first student made 1 to 5 dilution. So 1 to 5, we can represent this as a fraction. 1 over 5. Second step, then 2 milliliters of Z was added to 8 milliliters of water. So second step would be 2 divided by 2 plus 8. And we are going to get 2 over 10 or this is going to be 1 fifth. This is a dilution which we got with the second step and with the third step uh, lastly, the student made 1 to 20 dilution of the second tube. So third step is 1 to 20 dilution, which we can represent as a fraction, 1 divided by 20. So as you see, the student made three consecutive dilutions. So now we just have to multiply these dilutions. So 1 fifth times 1 fifth which comes from here and times 1 over 20, which comes from here. So 1 fifth times 1 fifth is going to be 1 over 25 times 1 twentieth. And the final dilution of the phage lysate is going to be 1 over 500. So we diluted our initial solution 500 fold in three consecutive dilutions. And this is all for today. Subscribe and see you in the next video. Goodbye.